What's up, modern steaders? Today, we need to get our roof strapped and get the roof sheathing put on. The composting outhouse today. Let's go up the ladder and get some measurements. Look at that. That's a beautiful thing. All right, just six feet. Awesome. And then, let's see what we need for a length all the way up top. All right, so overall length, we got 61. We're gonna put one at the very top, one at 16 on center, one at 32, one at 48, and one at the very end. So we need one, two, three, four, five pieces of strapping, six feet long. Let's go to the lumber yard. The best part is they had what we needed. Now we can get cutting them and get to work. We've heard back from two of the winners so far on the incubators. We're waiting to hear back from one more. I don't know if it's odd or not, but I'm looking forward to my compost and outhouse. I'm very excited for this project. To me, it's one more step closer to sustainability. We're gonna use our other bathroom still, but if we ever lose power or something happens with the grid, we're gonna have a composting toilet. You don't have to worry about running our well just to flush the toilet. That's a big thing when you've lost power for a week.
The nice clear roof on so we'll still have plenty of light. Window here and the window there. Be like a panoramic view when you're in here. If you enjoyed today's video make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you already haven't subscribed. Hit the little bell notification while you're there and that turns on notifications and lets you know every time we upload a video or when we go live. Oh, you're so fat and lazy, you don't even want to get up and get the apples. They're getting plump and getting ready for harvest season. See you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye.